Woody Show, Family Feud. All right. Hell yeah. I mean, because Seabass, we're always trying to take things to the next level. Next level. You know, like uh, whether it's uh, they do the Bachelor, Bachelorette. You know, now they got Golden Bachelorette, Bachelor, whatever it's called. Right, right. Golden that, Bachelor. You know, I got to find some old ladies. Yeah, we next level. <laughs> I'm saying we next level like what they were doing originally with just Bachelor, Bachelorette, you know, mm-hmm. make it more interesting. Share the uh, spotlight with many more people than just one. But, uh, now on the Family Feud classic game, sure. Of course. But uh, yeah. why talk to 100 people? For these questions when you can just talk to one you only need one you know and listen to them for like in real life listen yeah to like a real life mm-hmm. like yeah. you see it written down on a board so that's just how we roll people say zig we zag people say up we go down i you say know. it's innovative yeah it really is it really <laughs> is and it's a lot of fun so seabass is out there on these streets and uh he's got a person asking them the same type of uh family feud questions now we did Get uh, a, a win, right? Where Seabass is going to have to act normal. People have been asking about that for an entire day. Yeah. And, and see, this is one of those things I didn't want to rush because, like, I want to make sure that we pick our spot. We're not just kind of like, you know, right, using it and then going, oh man, you know what? Should've we really should have yeah. used it for, right? And you said May fourth is a Saturday. Yeah, yes. May fourth. Yes. Yeah. Damn it! He hates May the fourth. Be with you. Uh, mm-hmm. You know, but he's going to have to like, acknowledge people, and he can't say no, thank you when we say God bless you, yeah. like you know. <laughs> Yep. Got to do all that. Yeah, he's got to tell us about his weekend. He's got to. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yes, he's got to invite us into his life. <laughs> be like yeah. an alternate that universe. Was, yeah, he's got to act uh, like a normal person. Wow, for, well, for these are all the things you should put on your list. Very one, difficult. It's on the list. Uh, I don't see a list. Of course, you're not going to see the list. It's our list to put together <laughs> for you. Yeah, and we'll we'll have to uh, unveil it. Ooh. Anyway, is there any kind of uh, challenge this time around? Just well, a regular you guys round are of sitting on a win. I, I I can't offer you more of the same. So if you guys get. Two out of six matches in this round of the family, uh, Woody Show Family Feud, uh-huh. I will, from my own expense and all of my own doing, bring in two baby ducks and raise them to be adults here no. in the studio. Yes! No. Yes! No. I'm getting these no. answers. No. No. Two baby I'm vetoing ducks. that. We're done with animals oh, in the studio. Weak. If you want to have them, that's fine. You can do it at your place. I'm so over having it animals. It was so exciting. Like yeah, but, really now, but now when we walk in, I'm relieved. That yes, not here. it's so much cleaner. Ravi sent us a picture of uh, the Parents. chickens from uh, from last mm-hmm. yeah. last week, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, updated picture. They're huge. Huge. Nice. Yeah, huge. See that. You gotta show he, me. That. I will. And you wanted to keep them for two months. Yeah, or so. Yeah, or so. Yeah. <laughs> They're ginormous. They're huge. We have a patio. <laughs> can we get a Can we get a pizza? How about the new Little Caesars? Four quarter calzone. Yeah, how about that? All right, it'll, how, it'll be day of. Or day how about old. five of them? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> five quarters. All right, time for a Woody Show <laughs> Family Feud. Yeah. 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 Hey, you are matching with Diedrich, and to get you a little more info, like you, I was like, "What do you find these people?" Uh-huh. Yeah. Very easy. Diedrich was walking down the street okay. with a uh, margarita and a joint, <laughs> <laughs> and just having a walk. And he's gonna That's tell us nice. about that. Yeah. yeah. Just walking down here four miles oh, back and forth. Yeah. Just kind of getting some nice sun in. Yeah. Exactly. That's what we're doing right now. Oh, very nice. Like cocktail in hand, a blunt in one hand. Life is good. That's what right. a That's great day he's just, having. Walking yeah. around. Just vibing. It's That's just great. By the way, it's yeah. 2 p.m. on a Monday. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Got no worries. Well, it's on, he, dude, he's on his work break. It's on Island. Yeah, time. you know the vibe. <laughs> <laughs> this is Ravy's retirement plan. Yeah. Right. Oh, I'll get a now. cocktail. Yeah. Joy, well, just joy. And a yeah. blunt. Just walk and just so walk around. I'm good. See what happens. Right. <laughs> what a show, Family Feud. And uh, so, again, we have um, you know these questions. We just got to try to figure out. And this is this is the trick. This is where we were really kind of messed up for the first couple. We were really kind of thinking of like what answer we would give on the TV version of this. Sure, we got to think. Sure. We got to put our, our, our yeah. ourselves in the, in the shoes Diedrich of Dietrich. Yep. Yeah. And yeah. we'll start with Ravy. Okay. Uh, Ravy. Name something you will find on a breakfast buffet. Mm. See, I didn't give this to Matt because it'd be too easy. Breakfast easy. buffet. One touch. There's so many options. I know. Eggs. Yeah. Bacon. One touch pan- pancake mi- maker. That's possible. <laughs> <laughs> Sausages. <laughs> right. Waffles. <laughs> right. Hash eggs. browns. Eggs. So, okay, eggs. now look. I'm going to, yeah. you know what? I'm going to try to think about like where I would be if I was, if I was yeah. smoking a blunt, right. walking the streets. Yep. Oatmeal, margarita. Uh, the breakfast food that I would want, sorry, Sammy, would be bacon. Uh, and like bacon. A, a mountain I'm, of I'm thinking yeah. bacon yeah. as well. But I do agree with your answer. Yeah. Now, why? Uh, I would why, want why would you omelet. say that to Sammy? Why would you say she that? Hates Sammy hates bacon. bacon, which is weird, right? 
It is super yeah. weird. Yeah. And smell weird. I'm stupid. not Don't getting. Disgusting. You're a legal no. weirdo. Disgusting. Getting. Yeah. Oh, it smells awful. Uh, but that is what I'm going to go disgusting. with. I'm going to go with bacon. Right. That's, that's a good answer. answer. I like right. that. Bacon. I think that's good. All right, let's see if uh, we get a point. Name something you find in a breakfast buffet. Eggs. Oh. Ah. You like your eggs? Uh, scramble. Okay. Wet. So that's a soft right. scramble, right? Right, right. Soft scramble. Yes, sir. See, you you know about the white era because you see how you, you did that? Soft scramble. Because how many black people are going to ask how they want their eggs? Uh, you take these eggs how you get them. What the <laughs> are you talking about? <laughs> All right. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Soft yeah. scramble with some cheese up on it? That oh, is, yeah. Uh, I didn't know like soft scramble eggs was a white... Like I said, eggs and bacon was right. what came to mind first. Exactly. I didn't know that was a white person thing. But yeah. high <laughs> ravy wants bacon. You overthought it. Didn't know that either. Uh, Woody Show, Family Feud. Gregory. Yes. Name someone on whom people blame their problems. Oh, Ooh, wow. Okay. It'd be either general or specific. Right. See, my very first instinct would be mother. Yeah, say parents. I was going to say parents. Parents. Yeah, yeah. parents. parents. Uh, spouse. Yeah. Sure. Boss. Oh, girlfriend. Oh, when you're, when you're a parent, you can blame a lot of stuff on your kids. Kids. Yeah. Sure. Uh-oh. Kids are a great excuse for stuff. Mm. I say boss. Boss. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Your employer. Government. Government. Like a, government. Oh, that's good too. Government. Women. Maybe in this oh, case, yeah. women. Women in general. Just yeah. Women. So yeah, I'm putting myself in the shoes of uh, Dietrich. Maybe yeah. in this case, a police officer. Oh. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. I. Okay. Me personally, I would say parent, but I think Dietrich would say girlfriend. Or, okay. Or his his lady. Okay. Yeah, that's a good answer. I like All, right. It. All right. Good okay, answer. I'm just going with Baby that. Baby mama drama. What do you show family feud? Name someone on whom people blame their problems. Donald Trump. Everybody blame <laughs> Trump for something. Yeah, he's not president anymore, though. That's the problem. Why y'all still saying he f- with y'all if he ain't, if he ain't president no more? <laughs> Did he cause you any problems? Didn't cause me none. Matter of fact, if anything, he made me feel good because it took some of the pressure off me because now I ain't the bad guy no more. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, Woody, you said government. Yeah. Oh. I might have had to give it to you if you said government. Yeah. Uh, that's took the pressure off me. I'm not the bad guy. I'm not guy. the bad yeah. guy. Oh, that's funny. I see, that's a positive spin. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's good. All right. Uh, Woody Show, Family Feud, who's next? Let's go to Menace. Menace. Okay, yeah. Name a form of communication that few people use anymore. Good question. Mm. Uh, always be talking about his pager. Yeah. Letters. Mm, yeah. No, yeah. I'm saying uh, pigeon. Okay. Pigeon? <laughs> pigeon. That's if true. he's right on this, okay, can I make some kind of side wager if he's, I'm so confident he's wrong on this. You get a billion points. But, okay. but we, we've had this before where like right. he says something, something like that mm-hmm. and he yeah. ends up being absolutely right. And then he says, yeah. Yeah. Menace is kind of like the whisperer That's in this game. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I'm willing to make some kind of like a uh, wager. Okay. okay. Yeah, so you already made the pizza thing with him? Yes. Okay. Um, Five pizzas. <laughs> Menace, if you are right about this, yeah. I will bring in breakfast that includes someone making omelets. Ah, uh, on the Whoa. station. Oh, yes. what? Like a chef That's like my dream? Um, yeah. Oh, pray An omelet yes. station. Pigeons. 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 Oh, my God. Pigeons. Right. Is pigeon is yeah. that your final I'm answer? Locked in. Oh, sure. All right. Come on. Come on, dog. Good answer. Come on, dog. Pigeons. Let us pray. All right, here uh, we go. Name a form of communication that few people use anymore. House phone. The landline. Your landline. Ah. Do you know anybody's phone number still? Yeah, my auntie, because when I was in jail, she used to always help me out. Like, Bail yes. you out or? Yes. Yeah, that's good. Okay. But you stopped going to jail, I'm sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm here talking to you. Never again, right? Never again. Never again. Oh. Yeah. 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 And also, he, on mic, gave me his auntie's phone number, which oh, I really? cut out, of course. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Oh, man. Matt sucks, man. I could almost taste the omelet. Oh, no. Dang it. Yeah. I was already thinking, like, what kind of fixings I want in there. Yeah, yeah. me too. We would <laughs> want lobster. Yeah. Want yeah. Oh, no. I'd go some shrimp. You know, my favorite caviar. is, like, more like a Greek omelet. Mm. So, like, some ground, not ground, yeah. the, the roasted chicken Ugh. and some feta, man. some spinach. Oh, I thought you hated feta. Onion. No, I told you no, I like onion. I like the feta. I don't like. Goat, goat cheese. Meat. Yeah. Oh. Even though it's made, it's different. Like it's got a like I don't like. And you know what? It's a soft kind of like gooey. Yeah. Like. Mm. Nah. Mm. Yeah. Nah, nah, dog. Feta, I love. I love feta. Oh, Give me extra feta. Ooh. Yeah. Oh well. Ah, Darn it. Dang Woody it. show Family Feud. All right. Well, we missed. That was a good menace question there too. Mm-hmm. Uh, Sammy. Yeah. All right. What's something you do to freshen your breath? Uh, brush your teeth. Good answer. <laughs> I mean, that is. Brush yeah. your teeth. Good answer. Go with that. Uh, Stick with it. Mouthwash. Uh, Mints. Yeah. Gum. Mints. Gum. Right. Yeah. I say yeah. Uh, Listerine strips. Yeah. Let's go to Mr. Bodega Breath himself. Opposite of menace. 
<laughs> Listerine strips. Yeah. Bodega breath. Can, uh, I was candy. Is candy in there? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna stick with brushing your teeth. Yeah, good brushing choice. Your teeth. All right, that's, uh, that's a good answer. All right, that's a good answer. Let's find out if we uh, get a point yet. Name something you do to freshen your breath. Brush my tongue. Okay. Do you ever have a like morning breath? Someone rolls over, they want to kiss you. No, nah, cause I don't sleep with people like that. Oh no. Very rarely, cause I ain't in to have the muff roll over in the bed with me. All right. Oh. Wait, so that doesn't count? No. No. Because brush Man. your tongue is different than yeah. you said teeth. Yeah. yeah. Mm, silly yeah. me. Damn. This guy's too coherent. Yeah. Dude, <laughs> I you know. Yeah, he we're needs a few more hands normal. at that point. Yeah, we're thinking, overthinking yeah. all the answers. Yeah. I brush my tongue so aggressively that I gag. Really? really? You guys oh, do yeah. that? Sometimes, yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Once in a while. I feel like I haven't done it good enough Unless you until have a gag. I gag. Yeah. I yeah, no longer like, brush my teeth in the shower, but when I do, I gag brushing my teeth in the shower, but not. Outside At the, the same. shower. That's because you're not really. breathing the same way. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. Mm. Not through your nose. You're just... So Woody's yeah. there just going like. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, I get it all <laughs> the way in the back of my throat. Yeah, you do. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, Woody Show Family Feud. Let's go to Woody. Woody. Name something a man might do at the gym to impress a woman. What does that mean? Kidding. Gym. Gym. Uh, hmm. Can you explain gym? What, what is a gymnasium? Gym. Let's see. Man does uh, to gym. impress a woman. Oh, I would say like, like uh, make it rain, lifting, ball out, lifting real heavy weight. That's what I was That's thinking. That's what yeah. I was thinking. Yep. Like, wear chains. You know, chains. <laughs> like something, something above make their it building. Rain. Yeah, make At it rain. The gym. Make it rain. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would say lift a ton yeah, of weights. Yeah, I would say like a big lift. Heavy, heavy weights. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah heavy weight. Like, but they gotta. Yeah. Man, I'm not. Re this is not really I my mean, area like, of expertise. Know, anything that happens at a gym. So, like, like, what else would we do? Like, run real flex. fast on a treadmill. <laughs> right. Yeah, like, take, like, take your shirt off. Take your shirt maybe? off. Yeah, yeah. flex, flex. Uh, I see flex. guys do that so often. Yeah. Mm -hmm. just, uh, the right. Shirts there for. Yeah. Absorption. Yeah. Let me stick with Sammy and Menace. I'm, I'm kind of, or Sammy and uh, Ravi. I would like to get your from a female perspective. Then guys at the gym, what are they doing? What would to make try you to swoon? Yeah. I mean. If I saw any of this, like a big lift or a big shirt lift. off or a fast run, I'd be like, oh, what yeah. a try hard. Right, what, do you, what do you guys feel the best answer is? <laughs> I I mean, if assuming it's a really like ripped attractive guy, take your shirt, shirt off. off. Nice. Shirt off? Yeah. Yeah. All right. But I could see him lifting heavy weights. <sighs> I'm also trying to think of Dietrich. All right. I'll, you know what? I'm going to stick with my original answer, the uh, the gut and also because Ravi contributed it. From the female perspective, mm -hmm. I'll go with uh, lifting very heavy, heavy weight. Heavy weight. Right. You know, I like weights. that. Yeah, all right. Okay. Here we go. I think that's a very good answer. Right. I mean, the shirt thing could be. Hmm. All right, mm -hmm. let's find out. Name something a man might do at the gym to impress a woman. Do more lifts. Like if I'm doing eight, he gonna try to do twenty to impress her. You ever picked up a girl to the gym? No, I'm, I'm gay. I ain't oh. in it. I'm, I'm in the guys. I ain't got time to be with that woman. All right. Yeah. I ain't got time okay. for that. Is that a, so more that yeah. Not yeah, more reps? Yeah, sure. Why not? Yeah. All right. Yeah. yeah. We get a point okay, on that one? Yeah. Nice. Oh, really? Right. I saw a guy the other day at the gym. He took his shirt off because okay. he wanted to look cool. Yeah. More questions. And then he had to get a towel to put down on the bench because his shirt was off. Yeah, somebody. <laughs> but again, the shirt's there for a reason. Yeah. Somebody on the text said hip thrust. That's oh. a uh, you know, I get what you're saying, but that's a chick exercise. Mm. It is? Oh, absolutely. Mm. I mean, I see guys do it. I see guys do it occasionally. But it's a, it's a girl exercise. Is it really? Well, it's for your butt. Yeah. yeah. It's butt stuff. I know, but, like, but I, don't you want to have like a don't you want to have like a nice firm ass, fellas? There are other ways to do it besides <laughs> yeah. <that>. Uh -huh. <laughs> Lunges. It's squat. called yeah. lunch squat. Or deadlift. If yeah. you're menacerai, even though we're fat and disgusting, we have naturally firm asses. Yeah, we do. Yeah. Ravy you, touched him. You can that bounce is true. a quarter I was off actually kind of shocked. My yeah. ass. Dude, Menace and I have strength. like rock solid concrete asses. <laughs> yep. <laughs> you wouldn't think so. Like you couldn't mm. even get a finger in there. If we decided nope. that we didn't want anything going, like nothing, nope. like dude. Not happening. You're not breaking the plane. It's the Fort Knox of butthole. It really is. I'll drop the soap all day and still be confident that I'm yeah, good. That's right. Tooth on that. That's yeah. right. All right, let's get uh, <laughs> one more question here. What do you show Ravy. family feud? Yeah. Ravy, back to exercise. Mm -hmm. Name a sport that can be very peaceful. A sport that can be very peaceful. Hmm. Like the first cool. thing that came to mind to me was golf. Me too. Yeah. Or fishing. Fish. Okay, yeah, fishing. That's a good one too. Not really a sport, but a is called a sport. Right. Yeah, golf. golf. I would say I mean, golf. golf. Even though a lot of the golfers I know are rageaholics. Well, yeah. <laughs> they're I mean, out like, there 
throwing clubs. Well, they're, I think about like when you're watching golf or you know, yeah, yeah it's and how quiet, quiet. it is. And and and, yeah. Yeah. Although CBS used to pump bird noises right yeah. <laughs> on the on the telecast. <laughs> I, w- I would. Stick I, with I'm that. gonna stick with golf. You're gonna stick with golf. I'm That's gonna a good stick answer. with golf. Nice. I say croquet. Croquet. Yeah. I think Dietrich's gonna know croquet. Okay. Golf. Let's see if we get another point. Name a sport that can be very peaceful. Walking, because it's a sport. People do it. You ever do hiking, go up the hills? Yes, I've done that before in my white days when I was <laughs> young. Yeah. What does that mean? I mean, like when I was growing up, when my people were trying to make us be like white, you know? Oh. All right. Uh, well, we learned some things. Walking. We did. The sport of walking. What do you show Family Feud? Hey. Oh. People love walking and soft scrambled Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, we're going to take a uh, quick break. Nice play, everybody. Only one point, yeah. but it's still fun. All right. Yeah. That's what I like about that game. Even when you lose, it's still fun. Yep, true. No omelet station either. Oh. Yeah.